serving mid-Michigan. You're watching NBC 25 Today. Good morning, everyone. It's 6.30. I'm Kim Russell in for Liz this morning. Thanks so much for watching us this morning. We are having a great time. Brian is in case, but let's get a quick check of the weather with him right now. Brian, how's it looking out there? Well, it's looking nice this morning. We do have a bit of fog in the thumb and, and different spots. A lot of where a lot of water is, body of water. That's where we're going to see uh, most of the fog for this morning. But otherwise, clear skies, sunny skies. It's looking beautiful. Uh, at this point, triple Doppler will show us that we do have clear skies as well. No precipitation in the region or in the uh, or even really in the state at all. Look at some of the uh, temperatures across the area. We'll show this to you in the 50s and 60 in Auburn, 61 in Merrill and Perry. But as you can see, uh, Sandusky is at 54 and just up the road. East Tau is 63 and then 55 degrees here in Caseville. Here's what it looks like. Our forecast is in Caseville and Huron County in the thumb. This is uh, just along the bay. You can see at the time we hit 8 a.m. We'll be at 62 degrees, mostly sunny skies. By noon, we'll be at 75. And by the time we get to 5 o'clock, 80 degrees and sunny skies here in Caseville for Cheeseburger. It's going to be a fun time to be had by all. Stick around. Kev it up. We'll, uh, we'll dance a little jig. Feeling good this morning or uh, who knows. Uh, but we will be showing you the Cheeseburger bus. It's a big pink bus. Bunch of flamingos. It's a party bus that drives through town and makes its way all over the state to promote the Cheeseburger in Caseville Festival. That is coming up, and Travel Bid Michigan, that segment happens in just about 10 minutes. Kim? And you'll also be able to get down to the uh, to the amphitheater, and that's where we'll have uh, some good music going on this evening, also late into tonight. So the party continues all the way through the weekend. Kim, if you have a chance to get up here, do it. We're live in Caseville via Skype on the Internet. We're streaming this video to you. I'm in my parrot hat having a good time. Back and to you. Judging by that outfit, I'm guessing you fit right in with the Parade of Fools. <laughs> hey, I was the Grand Marshal, just so you know. <laughs> How fun. It looks like you're having a blast. We'll get back to you. Behave yourself. I and, never, never. I know. <laughs> I don't know why I even say it. And Hughes, he was live out in Caseville enjoying the Cheeseburger Fest. Good morning, Brian. Well, good morning to you, Kim. We're having a great time. You need to get out here. I know. I'm stuck in the studio. What's up with that? I, well, <laughs> I, I get Whoever the... Whoever planned this, all I have to say is bite me. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> You're so mean. <laughs> this is one of the t-shirts you got there. How dare you? Finally, <laughs> finally, someone could put me in my place on this morning show. <laughs> hey, we're having a great time out here uh, this morning, as we always do. Uh, it is going to be a, uh, another fun time today. You've got 11 o'clock this morning uh, down at the county park. It's a mud bath. You can take your kids to the mud bath and let them play in the mud. And then also you get later on this afternoon, there's uh, some Christian singing and classic songs that will be done uh, downtown here at the, uh, the Village Park. And then you can also head down to the amphitheater tonight. Stars on the Water will be playing. Uh, last night, Jimmy the Parrots played. They're going to be uh, they're going to be having more fun as we go into the weekend. There were sixty to seventy thousand people for the parade. And I don't know, Rob, but do we have some of those pictures um, pictures available just to them? Uh, we'll get to it in a We'll get to our uh, seven-day forecast, so here in just a bit as well. Here's some of the pictures. Boy, this was a, this was the biggest martini glass, and there was actually uh, martini juice in that little martini right there. Those girls were jumping up and down in it, having a good time. Uh, here's the other picture. This one is fairly, well, I don't know. How would you call it? Interesting? Uh, the deer. Um, I'll take shotgun. Um, that literally is a stuffed deer that was mounted on the back of that hog there. Uh, other pictures. These were just a whole bunch of ladies uh, dressed up for the uh, sweet potato, uh, sweet potato fun. It, the, the queens there. They made every drag queen jealous with all those pink dresses. I, the, here's Mark Torgrosa in his famous uh, coconut bra before he lost the weight. And then uh, <laughs> just fun times for everyone there's the real men in their coconut bras that were walking through the parade yesterday okay let's show you what's uh, going to be happening in regards to your seven day forecast look at those by the way sheep i didn't sleep like a sheep last i didn't count any hardly got any sleep i got phone calls all night seven day forecast shows us that we're going to get to 80 by today 86 for friday saturday and sunday Sunny skies, temperatures near 90, and then as we get to Tuesday, a 40% chance of some thunderstorms. So they'll hold off for the weekend, thankfully, Kim. 
Uh, I did get sunburn. I, a red lobster could recruit me right now, uh, and they'd probably get a, maybe a dollar out of me. But it, it, I'm sunburned like you wouldn't believe. But uh, we had a fun time. The yeah, festival continues all the way through the weekend, and um, I think I'll be back up here. Anyway. I cannot wait to see what pictures Mark Torgrosa finds of you after uh, that lovely coconut picture. That uh, you No, know, he's not going to find any pictures of me. He <laughs> tried to embarrass me in front of this entire crowd yesterday. I would not let that happen. <laughs> oh, my. We got a little bit of competition going on. You'll have to tune in tonight at 5, see what happens. <laughs> I'll take on the chief. Oh, come on. Come on. <laughs> we're, we're live by the way we're broadcasting live this morning via the internet on skype so if things look a little different that's why we're coming to you live via the internet thank you so much brian